Hey, what's going on everybody out there? I'm Jake James Lugo and welcome to the channel and welcome to a brand new episode of JJ's First 20. Uh, we're going to be looking at two classic games that got re-released on the Nintendo Switch. The first one we're looking at now, again, this is from Sega Ages, it's from Sega. Big shout out to Sega for sending me these games. We're going to first look at Shinobi and then the second one we're going to look at is Fantasy Zone. And uh, Shinobi, as you guys might know, again, if you're a big Sega fan, if not, I'm going to fill you in on this. Uh, Shinobi was a classic arcade game that had multiple sequels uh, across various different consoles. A lot of people really love uh, Shinobi 3 or Revenge of Shinobi that was on the Sega Genesis slash Mega Drive. But this is the original Shinobi from the arcade. Now, kind of like the other Sega Ages games, which has like different like additional stuff besides the arcade game that you could mess with, which we're going to take a look at the arcade game in a bit just to do some gameplay. We also have the Ages mode, which changes up a few instances or a few little aspects of the game itself. You could obviously load, which I have a save file here. I was kind of messing with the game beforehand. Uh, you could look at online rankings. You could look, obviously, at the manual. We could also go to the settings, and just to show you guys real briefly, you got the Japanese and international versions. We have the set, uh, what is it, difficulty settings, number of bullets, you know, bu uh, enemy bullets, or number of bullets, <laughs> number of players, and then enemy bullets, uh, the stage select, and a whole bunch of other different stuff. Uh, one of the cool things in here, besides the controls, is that you could actually change up a lot of the background effects and also change the effects of the game itself, you know, how it's displayed. Played. You can play with scan line and smoothing. You could actually play with nothing on, so you just get that pixelated look. You could also play with uh, just smoothing or just the scan lines themselves. Get that authentic feel, like if you were playing on a CRT TV. Uh, it looks kind of good. I personally, for me, again, just personal preference, I like doing it without anything whatsoever. And then the display mode, you could actually change it up and you could even go to full screen. You have a cabinet style, which is, you know, something specific to the, what is it, arcade like versions of these games that are the Sega Ages stuff. And the only problem is that when you go to vintage or, or cabinet mode, you have to play the game with scan lines. I wish that you could actually change it where it doesn't have the changing of the scan lines itself. Uh, and the same thing here with the vintage mode. Uh, that Again, that's just one of those things. I wish that you weren't uh, uh, able to just be locked to that. But again, this would be more kind of like the regular stuff. But the same thing with the cabinet. I would love just to have the cabinet, but no filter there. Uh, again, that's just my own little... My own little preference. And then you know, obviously you have a music player which has all the music in the game that's included here. And it's the same thing for Fantasy Zone, but we're going to get back into Shinobi here. Let's actually go to the Ages mode. Let's just try to, you know, again, since we're playing Sega Ages, let's try that bad boy out. Let's do this, son. Let's absolutely do this. So you've made it here to Ages mode. Joe Musashi, Joe, Joe Musashi will be clothed in perpetual white. Each of his strikes on the enemy will be at its strongest. Go forth as he awaits your move. Okay, so yeah. Basically, you get like a boosted up version of the game that allows you to do more damage and stuff. But again, this is the opening to Shinobi here. Mm. Let's have a little coffee as we're playing this. So he's got like a whole bunch. Look at that. He's got like a whole bunch of like crazy like attacks. Like they explode. Look at that. He's got like missiles. He's got like missiles on him. But let's do this. Whoops. Hold on. Hit the wrong button. Here we go. Let's start this bad boy out. Just again, just to show you guys a little bit of gameplay. Now, Shinobi, from my understanding, is not a long game. Ooh, I didn't want to do that, but look at that. I got a special attack he even has. There we go. That's my little tap, regular attack. Firing missiles at ninjas. Let's uh, rescue this person there. Look at that. Even the missiles take out the dudes with swords on there that they can't deflect the bullets. Because in the normal game, you should be able to just, again, shoot... Whoa. Shoot people, and then all of a sudden, they deflect some of the bullets. They won't go back at you, but they won't damage the enemy. So if you notice here, I also got hit once. So I got changed back to a red outfit. I think, I'm guessing that if you get hit like a couple times, then you're pretty much dead. I know in the original Shinobi, once you get hit once, it's over. Look at that. Check out, check out that Altered Beast stuff. You see that up there? The Altered Beast? Little cameo? Okay, so I got hit again twice okay so three times if you get hit you're dead so let's try that again he's got that little sound he's like then he jumps damn that guy just exploded did you see that ridiculous yeah, no shinobi missiles ah damn i didn't want that to happen yeah just like a, it's like a freaking running gun now not like an action like platforming game let's get him there now yeah, we're gonna go to the boss next Ooh. there we go i think we just got an extra life too so here we go this is the boss now ken o ken o let's get ken over here 
Ah, look at that. Damn it, ah. Try not to get hit by this. Ah, damn it. I was just about to kill him, too. It was just like a few more hits, it would have been over. But we could, let's try that super attack on him. Let's try that on him. So it does, does it, the special attack doesn't really do much. It didn't look like it did much at all. Unless it was just like so fast, I just didn't see it. But there we go. We got him. We finished him. Bonus stage. So I remember these, so... Okay, of course, the ninja got me. <laughs> Missed him. We failed. You fail. <laughs> mm. So now I enter the enemy's hideout. Let's do this. This is the area that I stopped at beforehand. But we'll just go a little bit further because then I want to get to Fantasy Zone. Just to show that version of the Sega Ages uh, collection. Now, Sega Ages, you could get this on the eShop right now. I'm playing this on Nintendo Switch. And uh, there's multiple games that are part of it. I'm pretty sure... In the past, I've looked at a few of the collection. There's been a few others that have been pretty interesting that have been included with it. I'm not sure if they're going to be releasing more anytime soon. I wouldn't be surprised for a lot of these classic games. It'd be kind of cool to see like a Sega Ages version of Altered Beast, since you guys know I actually like Altered Beast. Altered Beast is a game that does not get a... a... Oh, I did not want to do that. I did not want to do that, but I'll take it. Okay. <laughs> going to jump over that. Would it be awesome to get like a Sega Ages version of like Virtual Fighter? It'd be awesome to get like a Sega Ages version of Altered Beast. Maybe Streets of Rage, because I know Streets of Rage 4 is coming out sometime this year. That's going to be pretty cool. Got more of these guys that just destroyed them. Now it's funny because like every time he like grunts like that, it sounds like he's getting hit, but he's not. He's just jumping. Look at that now, because keep in mind, in Shinobi, you could actually sword swipe once you move up a little bit closer. Let's get this person over here. Ah, that was a little bit of health that we got, and we got messed up afterwards. Going all the way up. Ah, that guy turned into a ninja. Or did he get shot and then just, like... Came out of nowhere, like, right after that guy. So we got one life left. Let's at least try to defeat the second boss. Just to show you guys what's up with it. So we're moving around here. Let's go up. Oops. Can't go up that way. No, we gotta go up like this. Okay, there we go. Imagine that. A shinobi with a rocket launcher. Just nothing but straight up rockets for everybody. Let's go over this way. It's a ninja fight with rocket launchers. Like, these guys clearly did not come prepared for this fight. Yeah, we got him. We're getting everybody here. Ah. Did not expect that. And there we go. This is where the next section is. Okay. So now I think we go to the boss next. Yep, there's... Oh, actually, no. We got one more before the boss. Okay, so let's try to get to the boss. So now we got some platforming. Ah, really? That's dirty. That's really dirty. Ah. Oh, okay. So no, I can't go in the water. All right. I just want to... I thought for a second there I couldn't go in the water. I couldn't go in the water at all. That, that would have really sucked. That would have been really hard. That, I'm thinking like it's much harder than what it actually was. Ah! Okay, so hold on. There we go. We still got this. Let's keep going. Let's at least try to make it there. Firing missiles at everybody. Everybody's getting missiles, swipe, sword swipes. Ah, damn it. I thought that wasn't going to hit me. Okay, we got life, and then we got hit again afterwards, which is pretty funny. So there's the, the helicopter. That was a short level. You notice that? That was pretty short, actually. 4,000. Okay, so here we go. Now it's helicopter time. Let's do this. Let's smack him up. Yeah, it, it, that hardly did anything. So this this is pretty easy. Okay, that is very easy. 
Straight up. We took down an Apache helicopter. I think it's Apache. Some type of helicopter. It's probably the same helicopter from Super Thunderstrike, but there we go. Let's do this bonus round and then we're going to move on to Fantasy Zone. More ninja stars. I got more ninja stars for you. Go get... Shit, shit. Ah. Okay, so anyway, let's... That's that. So let's move on now to the next game. So here's the next game. This is Fantasy Zone, the Sega Ages version. Again, on Nintendo Switch. And I'm pretty sure it's on other platforms, too. You can check it out. Uh, we got a duff bunch of different other stuff here that's a little bit different than Shinobi. We've got the original mode, which is the original arcade game. we got Upa Upa mode, okay? As long as you have gold, you can freely switch your weapon of choice by pressing uh, L and R, quickly defeat enemies, and get out of those coins. Time attack mode, which is fairly straightforward time attack. And then, obviously, all the other stuff. Now, one thing that we are going to do, we're going to change up a few things so you know let's keep it on original mode new version trying to see like freestyle let's keep it original there because it's fairly easy but again like some of these older games are pretty damn hard let's boost up our lives and then i don't have any of this other stuff we got to get more moolah to get some of these unlockable so i'm guessing like extra bonus stuff little things you can mess around with let's change up the display mode okay that's the normal mode let's actually go Oh, we can display details. Oh, this is actually pretty cool. So on the side here, as you can see, like towards the left side, you could actually display some of the different weapons you could get and everything else. Now we could keep the effect off. We could change the background here, which gets rid of the display there. But I like actually keeping the display. That's actually pretty cool to me. Base marker. Off. Uh, what is it? Base marker. No, let's keep it off because it like brightens up everything. I don't see any other little thing there that it does. But the music... That's pretty cool. So it pretty much controls. All right, it's pretty straightforward. So let's dive into it. Let's try the original mode first, and then we'll go to Upa Upa mode. Just to check that out. Let's try the original mode. So this goes like, look at this. This is actually really cool. Again, this is what you would see in an arcade uh, cabinet, stuff like that. Let's enter the coin. Let's get started, okay? Long go far away in a space. In space, there existed a fantasy zone where a courageous hero. Oh, God, I can't even read that. But let's just blow stuff up now. Let's just blow stuff up now. Just blowing everything up, so. Get some coins. There's the shop. Let's go to the shop for a second. See if we can get some new weapons. Parts shop. Alright. So we have about two grand. Let's get us uh, a better gun. Are you doing a bit yet? First, let's get us the wings. Got the wings. The wide beam. Let's do that. So we got 1,400. We got twin bombs, we got the smart bomb, we got an extra ship. Let's go to the twin bombs. Let's get the twin bombs, there we go. So let's start equipping, let's equip all our stuff. We got the big wings, wide beam, okay, and then the twin bombs. Let's keep it like that. Let's do this, yes, yes. Big money, look at that. I'm trying to get all that coin, those stuff. So we gotta destroy all these like, little blimps. Now we have Grab all these coins. Nope. Ah. There goes my shot. It wasted my shot. So I have to get the shop again. To hopefully get it back. Very cool. So this game is pretty straightforward. So if you've never played it before. Again this is probably the first time you've seen it. It plays like any other like shmup. That just has again as you saw the upgrades and everything else. Which is pretty dope. Pretty awesome. We just gotta do a lot of dodging. At least the big wings allows me to be a little bit faster than normal. As we destroy all these here. Like, no coins there. Let's, where's that other one? Okay, there we go. When you go all the way to the side, you loop back around, which is good. So all that is destroyed. So, all right, here we go. Boss time. It's boss fight time. Now, I'm just trying to hit it in the mouth. Ah! Damn, I was hitting it in the mouth. I was trying to get rid of it. Okay, hold on. And I don't have... Oh, no, I still have my upgrades. So, here we go again. Got him. Okay, yeah, that's fairly simple. Even though we lost the life there, it's not that bad. Let's get all these coins. Big one. Ah, I didn't get all the coins. I didn't get all the coins. Yeah. 
Well, let's go to the shop. Let's see if we can get some more better weapons. Okay, so now we got six grand now that we can spend on this stuff. Let's go with jet engine. Of course, we need a jet engine. Let's go for... Huh, since we got five grand, let's try to get a, a seven-way shot. Yeah. Let's go for a seven-way shot. That actually sounds pretty good right about now. Now, let's keep it like that, and then... Yeah, okay, we're good. So, we'll exit out. We'll, we'll try to save up our cash, because we spent a lot on the seven-way shot. Seven-way shot, a jet engine, a single bomb, because we don't have our other bombs from before. Okay, so now we got to really gather these coins here. Mad coins. Look at that. Like, we're really fast right now. Like We're much faster than we were with the wings. Man, there's no hardly any shots there that we got. Trying to get mad money here. There we go. Let's see, we got this. We got this. We're not getting shot down. It's all good. Ah, damn. We went right into the thing afterwards. Like, go figure, right? Okay, hold on. Let's try this again. Let's try this again. Now, so far, as far as, like, an interesting game is concerned, as far as, uh, these being fun, again, these are classics, so unless you're into classic games, you're not really gonna be, uh, too much into this type of stuff. I mean, if you love retro games and arcade games especially, or if you're just a big Sega fan, I would definitely recommend checking these out, you know, for a lot of Sega history. And again, they're so easy and and uh, cheap on the eShop. You know, simple to get into. And they have, a, a you know, a bunch of different features. Again, if you're into the retro gaming, oh, Jesus Christ, look how many enemies are on the screen coming out. We gotta start firing at things. I should've used bombs, but I should be doing. Ah! It was that single bomb, son. We got destroyed. Let's try this again. Okay, let's go to the shop. Let's get some stuff. Let's get some stuff right now. Because we got a laser beam we could get. Let's try that. Let's get a laser beam. Let's also get twin bombs. As we better get, we got a fire bomb. We got a smart bomb. Heavy bomb. A big one. Let's go with a smart bomb. Smart bomb's actually pretty good. Then we can't get our... Oh, can we get our jet engine? Yeah, we can get our jet engine. Yeah, so we can move around faster. So we got the jet engine. We got all this stuff. Smart bomb, lasers. Okay, let's go. We got lasers, son. Getting all that coin. Where's the other... Oh, no, we got to go back this way. Because we got to get to this thing. Got him. Okay, there we go. Whoa. And so much for the laser. <laughs> laser shot. Pretty much done. Look at all these coins. All the greed. Okay, hold on. Let's go back this way. Whoa. Let's go back around this way. Just get to that. Ah, whoa. Ah, dang it. Dang it. No, we're still in this. We're still in this. Back up, son. Now, funny enough, like, we can't change our... Our weapon, right in the middle of this, in the other mode, Upa Upa mode, I believe it was called. Okay, here we go. A big sun. Oh crap! What is that? Whoa! Ah! Okay, hold on. I'm trying not to get it rained on. Okay, we got this. Okay, he's done. Oh wow, that was it. Mad money. Mad money right there. Okay, where's the shop at? Where is the shop at, son? Okay, we got that. Two grand. Got him. Got him. Alright, so let's go back down this way. Gotta go the other way. Away from everything here. Destroy that. Got it. Oh, damn, miss, how did I miss that missile? How did that missile not do anything? You saw that? Missile did nothing there. Now, I will admit, like, a lot of this stuff is pretty weird, as is this genre. This genre, the shmup genre, could get pretty weird with their designs, but they are very creative overall. You know, different developers that, that have games that are shmups or considered shmups. 
I've seen some weird ones out here. If you ever played Wings of War, which is another game on Sega Genesis, that's another... Ah! Got destroyed. Dang it. Game over. Ah! So there you go. That's Fantasy Zone. But let's check out the other mode of Fantasy Zone. Let's actually see how that is. Hmm. If we play a start, we could go back. Or actually, you know what? Let me enter my name here. JJ on top, the top of the charts. First rank, son. So let's go back. Go back to the game's menu. You know, on score was recorded in the rankings. Oh, okay. So I was like, wait a second. Why is it not moving? But it was actually saving out the rankings. So let's go back to the start menu. Whoops. Gotta hold it. Instead of just selecting, you gotta hold it. I don't know what's up with that, but it's still, you know, it's still totally fine. So, we got the time attack mode. Ooh, professor in light. Okay, so, as long as you have gold, you can freely switch your weapon of choice by pressing L and R. So, let's just do that briefly. You know, check it out for a little bit. Again, this might be a shorter uh, JJ's first 20. If we could even hit the 20 minutes, because 10 minutes of Fantasy Zone. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Let's go over what this mode is all about. This mode, you'll not only be, uh, by selecting... In You'll not only begin by selecting your engine, you'll also be able to toggle between weapons displayed on the left and right sides. So, L and R, you can pretty much switch between them. Each shot of your weapon depletes your gold, so shoot wisely. If your gold runs out, you revert back to using the standard weapon. Okay, interesting. Maybe wise to charge up your gold from your stock, from your coin stock beforehand for easier progression. Fill up the coin stock and tackle on the challenges. Okay, here's the first time, here's a, here, here's a gift to you as a first time bonus. It's up to you now to gather and save up coins. So... Okay, we got two. Sh we got a shot and two bombs. Okay, so let's go with the uh, let's go with the rocket engine just to see how it is. Like the big freaking rocket engine. Okay. Whoops, the wrong thing. Okay, no, you gotta hit uh, select there. So wait, from my own coin stock that I save up in the other previous mode is what I'm gonna add here. So let's go with ten grand, <laughs> just just in case. Okay, so let's try this out. Hopefully we do well. We're just spending... We're... What is it? They say time is money, but shots... Whoa, jeez. Look how fast this looks. Whoa. Ah, whoa. Okay. So much for that. But I still get to keep the engine. Okay. So here we go. Let's do that. Okay, there we go. I'm trying to fire. Oh, okay. So, no, I have to hit the other button. Like, I'm trying to hit the fire button, and I keep getting the standard laser. But... You do that. Okay. Okay, there we go. Okay, so that, that was the side. That was the bombs I was using before. So, you could actually waste money like this with the shots. Okay, I see how they get you now. Because I gotta grab this coin. Grab this coin. Look at this. Look at, it, look at me walking on the ground with my little legs. I remember he was in, a What is it? In Sonic and Sega All-Stars Racing, I think it was. And he had the little legs like that. That's actually pretty funny. Okay, hold on. Let's let's go with the wide beam. Ah, dang it. Ah, I didn't even see that shot there. We're getting blown up here. Okay, so hold on. Let's go with the seven-way shot. Just destroying stuff like it. Jesus, it wastes so much cash. Oh, man. You gotta be freaking shrewd. Whoa. <laughs> Did not see that. You gotta be shrewd in order to get this... In order to not waste your shots. Ah, dang. And I'm moving so fast, I can't control it too much. So fast. Okay, let me get this coin. So I walk around. Like, and he walks around, like, super fast, too. When you have the big engine. Whoa. Hold on, okay, hold on. Ah! Dang it. I was trying to switch at the same time while not paying attention to where I was going. Okay, so that is pretty clever, but you got to use your own stock of coins from the game itself in order to deal with that. So that is pretty tough. Let's just put our name in the board here. Gotta do that. It is clever. I'm not gonna lie. But let's go back now to the main menu. Okay, it's, it's submitting your score to the, to the rankings. Okay, that's fine. Let's go back here to the main menu. Now, I want to see if there's any of that stuff... Okay, because we got 142,000. Let me go to the, the, what is it, the options here. So, you have to get 250,000 to unlock that stuff. So, let's try it one more time to see if we can actually unlock what these are. Because I'm curious what these eat, what these are, you know, in any sense. So, let's go back again to the original mode. So, we can build up our stock. 
and actually try to get as much as we can. Here we go. So we do that, see what we got here. That slow moving goofiness. There we go, get some more coins. Trying to get the, the coin thing over here. Let's just change up our parts. So we, let's just get the, instead of the, let's get the regular jet engine, instead of the turbo jet engine. And then let's also get the Y beam. Uh, no, not the Y beam. Let's go with the, yeah, you know what? Let's go with the Y beam and then twin bombs. And then we'll do that. And it'll be kind of equipped a little bit there, a little bit better. So now let's go. Because we can't shoot, we can't shoot wildly like in another uh, shmup game. We have to be tactile with our shots here. There we go. Get all that coin, son. Mad coin right now. So we can shoot our regular shot, no problem. But like all these other shots, like we have like ammo we gotta conserve. Which is important. So here we go. Let's go up this way. Let's keep going. Let's see what we got here. Steal with the boss. Ah, whoa, those come back? I didn't know that. <laughs> I didn't know they come back. What kind of nuts is that? So we just got 4,900. Almost five grand just now for this stage alone. Oh, damn. Got him. Okay, so that was fairly easy. Not that bad. Hmm. So much coin right there. We got 1,200. Well, let's get another weapon. Let's get another weapon here. Uh, so we go the same way shot? No, because we want to save coin. Let's get a. Uh, let's get the laser beam. Let's get the laser beam. Work with that. Twin shot, small wings. Okay, cool. Nice. It just destroys it like immediately. It's like no. Cool. Let's get all this coin. I want some of this coin. Eh. Yeah, it's kind of missed that coin there. Okay, no, we got that coin there, though. We're getting more coin. And the laser has very little ammo, I noticed. Nice, okay, we got that. A lot of enemies popping up just randomly now. Just coming at us. They got problems. They got mad problems right now. Okay, here we go. Deal with that. Deal with that. Cool. Ah, dang it. Got shot down. <laughs> I think we got, like... Okay, we got two ships left. Okay, so no, hold on. Let's 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 regroup here. Let's get, a f let's get the, the wide shot, since it's cheaper. Let's get the... Let's get, uh, instead of the wings, let's go for the turbo? No, let's go with the regular jet engine. Let's do it like that. So, we have that. We don't have the small wings now. So, there. Oh. More coins. Got him. Get those coins there. Let's try to go over this way. There we go. We wanted to get to that. Ah! Wait a second. Was that timed? Because I only I didn't shoot a lot. With that. Maybe it was timed. Like, you can only just use it for a certain amount of time. Then if that's the case, then maybe shooting wildly at first would be a good idea. Okay, so here's the boss. It's boss fight time, ladies and gentlemen. So it's fairly easy. Fairly easy. There we go. We got it. That's a fairly easy boss fight. Fairly easy. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Let's, get, let's get all the coins. Let's get all those mad coins, son. Got 2,500. That's what I'm talking about. Yes. 2,500 bucks. Mad money. Okay, hold on. There's the shop. Let's kind of give us... Let's give us uh, the wide beam. It was the wide beam. And then we're good with everything else, I think. And you know what? The twin, twin bombs, I think that's cool. There we go. Okay, we're good with that. There we go. There we go. Whoops. So they're like laying waste to like all those dudes that are just popping up out of nowhere. Ah, damn it. No. No. Back up. 
More bombs. Okay, just destroying all these things that are just coming at us with, with an issue. It is a lot now. <laughs> There's a lot more than before. Okay, so uh, we got one more, I think. Or no, two more. Two more, so it's one and two here. Oh, no, we got one more in the back. Okay, so no, hold on. We have to work our way over the other side. I just want to get rid of some of these enemies that are just, like, coming at us. Oh, no, we got everybody. Okay, no, we're good. We're all good. Where's the boss now? There he is. It's like a moon. It's like a really weird... Okay, hold on. Ah, dang it. I did not want that to happen. Okay, I get it now that you have to just shoot the... You have to shoot the different little guns right here. So, hold on. Let's guess where he's going to start. Okay. There we go. Oh, wow. It gets faster. Oh, hold on. Uh, eh. That's much faster. Much faster. Oh, it's much ridiculously faster. Ah, dang it. Ah, dang it. I knew that was gonna... I knew that was gonna happen. I knew that it was gonna happen. It was like, I'm trying to, like, tiptoe on it. It was like, no. Let's destroy the top first. Let's, like, focus on it. go nope nope absolutely not back up son holy crap ah so many lasers so many lasers the lasers just coming out ah dang it oh no whoa no oh god okay Got a tippo on it. Got him? Okay, we got him. There we go. That was close. We got him. We got him. And hold on, let me get all the... I didn't get all the damn coins. I wasn't even paying attention. So, yeah. So, I think that's going to be good. Let's let's kind of end it there. Let's uh, also just buy this. Or no, buy that. Ah, didn't want to spend both, but fine. Get that, and then get the wide beam. Okay, we're good. And I'm going to save it right there for me. Let's save it. A little bit better, override it. Okay, there we go. Whoops. Kind of go back just to see if we got enough for it. I don't think we did. I don't think we got enough. So 2,500. Ah, oh, damn, we're just below. So, yeah, I just have to keep playing it, see how much money I could get and stuff, you know, to unlock that. It might be just some extra versions or, like, little modifiers for the game itself. It's pretty cool. Again, if you love classic games, especially Sega games like this, this will be right up your alley. If you're not so much into classic retro stuff, then maybe not. Uh, but even so, I still have fun with it. I still think it's pretty cool. Again, big shout-outs to Sega for sending this over to me. It's Again, it's on Nintendo Switch right now. It came out today, actually, uh, since I've had it for a few couple of days here and there. But anyway, let me know what you guys think about all this stuff. If you enjoyed this JJ's First 20, again, it roughly is a little bit over 20 minutes or so of gameplay. But talk to me in the comment section down below. Don't forget to leave a like on this video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Check out the Patreon page. Join the official Discord. There's a lot of stuff for you guys to love. I will talk to you guys again very soon.